Hey everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to talk about the four different types of goods. In economics, goods are usually classified according to two characteristics or attributes, excludability and rivalry or rivalrousness. Excludability describes whether or not it's possible to prevent somebody from consuming a good. Rivalrousness or rivalry describes whether multiple people or groups of people can consume the same good at the same time. With that said, we can then categorize all physical goods into one of the four following types of goods, depending on whether they are excludable or non-excludable, and whether they are rival or non-rival. The four types of goods are private goods, public goods, common resources, and club goods. With that said, let's get started. Let's begin with private goods. Private goods describe all products that are both excludable and rival. This means that anyone who is not the owner of the good can be excluded from consuming it, and that good can only be consumed by one person or group of people at a time. These types of goods always have an owner and usually have to be purchased before consumption. Some examples of private goods include products like food, clothing, cars, etc. Next, we have public goods. Public goods refer to all goods that are non-excludable and non-rival. This means that nobody can be prevented from consuming them and they can be used for, by multiple people or groups of people at the very same time. These types of goods are typically supplied by the government and paid for by taxpayers. Some examples of public goods include emergency services such as law enforcement or fire departments, as well as things such as national defense or municipal roads. Next, we have common resources. Common resources include all goods that are not excludable, but they are rival. This means nobody can be prevented from consuming them, but they can only be consumed by one person or one group of people at the same time. This specific combination of attributes often results in overconsumption of these types of goods, which is known as something called the tragedy of the commons. If you want to know more about that, we can make a video in the future. Some examples of common resources include freshwater fish, forestry, or pastures. Finally, we have club goods. Club goods refer to all goods that are excludable, but non-rival. This means individuals can be prevented from consuming them, but they can be used by multiple people or groups of people at the same time. Some example of club goods include products such as gym memberships, cable television, or Wi-Fi. So once again, let's refer to this table to summarize everything we've covered so far. There are four types of goods, which can be classified according to excludability or rivalry or rivalrousness. Private goods are all goods that are both excludable and rival. Public goods refer to all goods that are non-excludable and non-rival. Common resources are all goods that are non-excludable but are rival. And lastly, we have club goods, which refer to all goods that are excludable but non-rival. So there you have it. Now you know how economists classify the four different types of goods. If you like this video and are excited to see more, let us know by liking the video, subscribing to the channel, and comment what sort of economic topics you'd like to see us cover in the future. Thanks for watching this video, and we'll catch you in the next.